Department 6A, uh, Vice Chairmanship. Um, several, for the past several years, it's my understanding that the, the Vice Chair uh, has been chosen from a rotational basis. Um, and when the commission did change its, um, from three to five, it went to an eight month cycle and each of the commissioners would have the opportunity to serve as vice chair. Uh, of course, the question has come up about whether that's the way to do it or whether that individual needs to be elected from the body. Um, and so that's, that's what this is. I would like to get this clarified and get the, uh, get the uh, a decision from the commissioners as far as the way that they would like to do this, either continue with the way we're doing it or elect a vice chair. Any questions? Mr. Chairman, I, I'd like to um, read something for point of clarification. It's on the enabling legislation in section 10. I'm not going to read all of it. I'll just read the first sentence. It says the board shall elect one from the dis from district representative to serve as vice chairman. It doesn't say how long it has to be. Um, you know, eight months is too fine with me. But it was just something I think that needed a point of clarification and I uh, wanted to make that known to the other commissioners and appreciate you putting that on the agenda. Okay. Any other questions? Any comments? Um, if county attorney could weigh in, or would, are we in violation of that that statute, um, Walter? If we if we rotate the vice chairmanship, uh, no, no, not at all. Um, let me uh, add to what the chairman explained. Um, before the terms were staggered. The chair and three district commissioners were all elected at the same time for uh, the same four-year term before the stagger. At the beginning of that four-year term, the commissioners had an election, and under that election, one commissioner was elected vice chair for the first 16 months of that four years. Another commissioner was elected the vice chair for the second 16 months and the third for the third 16 months, which totals the 48 months of that their continuous term. But there was an election of the three at the beginning of the four year term of those three commissioners to serve as vice chair for those respective 16 months. Then uh, we went to a staggered commission so that the time period that the four members of the commission were together it was reduced to two years due to the stagger. So at that point, the same process was followed at the beginning of the uh, two-year period and the commissioners had an election electing one for eight months, the second one for uh, eight months and the third one for eight months. Now we have five district representatives instead of three. You still have an only a two-year, uh, 24-month term. You know, obviously, 25 doesn't divide evenly <laughs> into 24, but you could nonetheless have an, uh, have an election to stagger the any number of you, whether it's all five or less than five, for, uh, excuse me, to rotate any number of you or all of you for the uh, uh, portion of the uh, 24 months that the five of you will be the district representatives together. So you can have a rotation provided it is an election at five vote of the commissioners. Does that answer your question? Do we need to take the vote, you know, because there are staggered terms, do we need to take the vote every eight months or do we need to take the vote? This particular body can take the vote and that rotation can exist as long as this 
body stays together, but if someone leaves and another person is elected, there would need to be another election. All of that. Yes, okay. you can take the vote to establish the vice chairman for the remainder of the 24 months that the five of you will be the five district representatives. You can do that now uh, by vote, whether it's one of you to serve as vice chair for the remainder, whether it's two of you or whether it's all five of you to fill a portion to serve as vice chair for a portion of the of the time period. Does that answer your question? Yes, it so does. who's on first? <laughs> it does. It answers the question. Thank you. Mr. Chair, I just wanted for clarification, um, um, I'm glad we brought it out because I wasn't aware of it. I was there when you know the chairman told me George Hughes was no longer the, the vice chair. And Richard was the chair, and I was wondering was it a demotion or is it something that he appointed? Then I went back to the legislation and was trying to get, you know, get some answers, and I saw about the election there. But I appreciate you know us at least bringing it out. Sure, I, I was the same way. I found out about it in the parking lot. Okay. Any other questions? Okay. Hearing none, we'll move on to C.